Hello, and welcome to Space City Tutorials. In this episode, we are going to take a look at a program called Autopsy. What Autopsy is, it is a GUI interface for a program called the Sleuth Kit. And what that does is that actually is used by law enforcement agencies and um, computer forensic analysts, people who need to recover deleted stuff. Um, I'm going to show you how you can use it to recover stuff of your own. So here is a flash drive I have inserted. It's a 30 gig flash drive, just USB stick. There's absolutely nothing on it. And just to make sure, I'm going to format it. And it is done. Okay, so now we're really sure that it's all done. It, it's all gone. Um, so what happens? Okay, you have a USB stick, you have the super important stuff on there, and it got deleted. Now what? Well, now is you when you want to run this autopsy per program. We will create a new case. We'll name it whatever we want. We'll call this um, USB or I don't know, test maybe. At this, like I said, it's used by law enforcement. So, you know, they have case numbers for us. It's not really that important. And now we have to pick is pick a logical disk because, well, we have a flash drive that we want. So we'll click Next. There are several plugins here that you can choose from. Um, you can keep them all you know, checked, it doesn't really matter. Um, I have these three unchecked because I know I'm not looking for that stuff. So I'll click Next, and I'll click Finished. And that's gonna analyze these files. And while it's analyzing, it's going to take a little while. It stays at 60% for probably about two or three minutes. And then it jumps up to 100, like almost immediately. So we'll let it do its thing. And then when it's done, I'll come back and show you what to do next. All right. And it has finished analyzing the files from F. So what we want to do now is we want to go to Views, File Types, by extension, I mean, you can look at it, you know, by MIME type and all that, deleted files, all 46,000 of them. I like by extensions because it organizes them in a way. And, I mean, that's insane. Look at all these files it found. Now, it's from the F drive. There's obviously nothing here. I formatted it like three times. Um... Yeah, and it's still finding stuff. So if we find an image that we want, this little U icon, I guess, um, we can right click on it, extract the file. It'll put it in export by default, which is in that test directory that we put on my desktop and save it, file extract it. So we can go to that test directory, export, and here it is. That's it. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it helps out. And until next time, have a good one.